However, I want to get my horns back. Did it! Okay. Yes! Just move on now. No. That's all work. Okay, good. The quests are separate. It just doesn't work unless you find the stable. So the gimmick here is this person, you know, we were teamed up with this guy. <laughs> Don't point that uh -huh. at me. Taking care of a very rare golden horse that Zelda owned. Poor thing ran away. Hmm. Horse fan, I don't like yeah. Gentle creature. Broke free. You just literally go grab the horse. I'll get it. Oh. Then we get to go to that other quest. Oh. It's literally up over there. Yeah. I'll go. Don't worry. Not even that hard to get, however. Yeah. So we can find my way back. There's just... No. So, they said north past the monsters. You just generally run. There's the Gleog and some other shit. There's a group of horses. Just keep an eye out for a golden horse. Just mixed into the regular ones. Stands so, out. Oh, no way. Is it, right. uh, this is, I think, the direction some of the enemies were in. It's just a random, like, moblin or something going to be on the horse. No, no. It's just mixed in with regular horses. It's mm. just shiny and gold, but you need to kind of avoid the Gleok. I wonder if that name is a translation error, considering it's from Zelda 1, probably. Gleok was a Zelda 1 boss. Yes. And those are Gleoks. And because it's a multi-headed dragon, this modern redesign looks a lot like King Ghidorah. Huh. So, well, that's uh, two games we've recorded uh, recently where I've made a King Ghidorah uh, a reference. It's not a lot, but it's weird it happened twice. Okay. Kind of ignore him. Hmm. Just kind of run around in the fields until we see it. Not inherently hard to find. Oh, god damn it. That's why I save, then go to the reset, because I'm going to get shot at. Fucking oh, okay. Okay, he shoots the beams because he shoots the beams. He actually like doesn't have that much range in the sense of it's not like uh, it would be off screen and you're going to get like blindsided or something. Just kind of around here. I just don't remember the exact. Spa is just kind of sitting out in the field. Fairy fountain. Yeah. 
I don't remember the exact position of this though. I feel like to make this difficult, it it probably is somewhat closer to the Gleok. Because that would be my guess to try and make this difficult. <clears throat> When you, when you find it, it's not that bad, but then you just have to kind of walk it back here. Right. I want to see what she says. What kind of follows it? Okay. Horrors, scared. Describe a uh, huge yeah. monster. Oh. You haven't heard it. Three heads. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is near the fucking. <laughs> and they give you a, they give you a stamina potion for this. Oh, oh, good lord! It is near the monster. He is closer in that direction, oh boy. <laughs> Worth coming back for that, though. I love how the game gives you a stamina potion for this. In case you approach too close, which I believe the actual area it is is like down here. Wrong little avatar. Just mixed in with some other horses. Wait. Alright. Oh, yeah, he put your. Oh, I saw some horses over here. No, god damn it. I don't want to <laughs> waste too much time. There's that, like, really close to the Gleonk, there's that building, and that building, I think, has a door in it, so it might be under that thing. No. Whenever I see, like, footage of this, it's just out in the fucking snowfield. You just find a bunch of horses, and there's just the golden one mixed in with them. And most people never get close enough to the Gleok to get attacked. So I don't know where the fuck it is. I'm gonna waste all my fucking day. Get some meat. Running around, constantly saving. I fucking damn it. Trying to stay just out of the range because I don't. Most people when they it doesn't seem to go this way. So no, most people when they do this kind of run past 
the Gleok, and I've never seen anyone get close enough to get it to aggro. Because everyone says, oh, it's kind of near it, but like, oh, this is so simple. It's like, oh, the scary dragon seems intimidating, but it's like you can literally just ignore it and just go this way, and the horse is like supposed to be like right here. But I don't see any fucking horse here. I don't see any here. Let's reach this past the... I think it's the draw distance fucking us up. So on the north side, and this would be Y. Yeah, because things are starting to load. Hmm. Oh, yeah, there it is. Okay, yep, that works. No, it was past them. Pat? Okay, yep. I can cut around because I can see it from here. It's that horse right there and that's why people said if you circle it's like you you can stay out of the gleox range and this quest isn't that hard but you do gotta approach and you do have to this one needs taming but if we don't naturally have enough stamina oh everyone can tame it with just a natural like bar you just have to be really good at the Mashing, and I have like half an extra bar anyway. Plus, we you could pause in the middle, yes, and drink the yeah. But I have hello, you golden asshole. You might, I think, the um, kid walking around makes noise and can irritate things, so you might want to turn him off for a minute. We'll never see it coming. Yeah, I... No. Dismiss. Wait for it to stop. Save again. I'll start walking slow, not making a lot of noise. Say. Mm. Like I said, the spirit of the matter. You're gonna have to barely make any noise like that. <laughs> I won't end, goddammit. It's not making any noise. Mount. <laughs> huh, yep. Just. Just enough of a basic wheel. Okay, so I don't want to save right now. Yeah, that's why I marked the. I was like, I guess you could turn the spirit back on then. Oh, I can't summon on a horse. I have to wait until you get back to like, the stable. That's why I have that. Marked anyway, let me drop the red pin. Try not to piss this thing off. Shouldn't it, like, shouldn't generally, as long as you don't use all three of the speed boost, you'll be fine. 
long as you keep telling me like using the first, maybe using two, never use the third one. And you should be fine. Well, that, I can do this. One boost. Soothe. Boost. Boost. Soothe. Hmm. Soothe. 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 This is also, by nature, a more gentle horse. What well, was Zelda's horse, so I assume it would be. And then there's the stable right there. I have my star and my pan, and you can see the stable on the map. Boost. Boost. Uh. You, te you technically ran for I'm that. turning. Person. Delete. Damn. And add a star. Just delete. Um, boost. Soothe. Soothe. It's fine. Soothe. Don't want to anger this thing. As generally, as long as you don't use all of the boost, you should be fine. Yeah. It's finally very calm. Not all about it. That's Princess Zelda's steed for certain. I've been worried sick, but you found it. Hey, when did you? Oh, never mind. So, partner, when you show up and save the day in the middle of my reporting work here, well, it kind of throws me off my saddle. You know what I'm saying? Just giving you a hard time. Oh, in this position, there's only one thing for a journalist to do. Starts rolling up his sleeves. Doing me a favor if you kept this gentle creature. It's probably because the one Rito, like, is a... To basically is, like, a... It's probably like the like, type of bird he is, but he really makes me think of Morgan's from uh, a One Piece. Yes. Which, okay. Oh yeah! Which the other thing I love about Morgan's apparent in a lay he a bird Zoan, meaning he is basically like always in a hybrid form. Okay. Okay, there's a problem. Dog's in the way. One pony point. I have a couple of other pony points. Prince oh, Princess Zelda's golden horse! We were well acquainted already. You mean to register it? Yes, please. Horse will be in good hands. Oh, yeah. This is more rigged. People always kind of get gentle temperament and like these stats. Okay. Making this one of the best just gen well, generic workhorses, but if we go find the horse guide, you can level up horses in this game. So if I wanted to for memes, if I go find the horse guide, I can keep shoveling food into this. Mm. Yeah. It's a special promotion. Register your first horse for free. Yeah. Oh, that's two points. I don't, and I had two from a kid. Oh, wait, wait, to, uh, I believe you need three points for the You know the name of the horse. To... I think I have the perfect name. I think it will fit. It's a joke. Oh, perfect. Gold Rush! Uh, you see, because the gold, the gold rush 
was a time in America where everyone was looking for gold. Yeah. But this is a horse. Mm -hmm. So it's gold rush. Because it's... A go uh, yeah. I'm clever, I swear. Gold rush! Was it being Zelda's horse? I would have expected it to already have a name, but... Four doors. Now, if we have four points in total, if we talk to the stable again, we should be able to get the reins. And a horse is from the first game. They're like three from the... I believe you have to talk to the person inside to... They said the leisure? No. Yeah. Receive reward. reward. I think that... Yes. Yeah. 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 We got this. Towing harness! Yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay, we can do everything now. For five points, you get the horse god fabric. Oh, we had more than four then. Towing harness is easy to get. It said it was just three points. Gold rush! You see, it's a joke because... Okay, just go back to the other stable now. It's time for the question of the day and my overall thoughts on the topic. So, anyway, how many of you also ended up doing what I did and basically walking past Zelda's golden horse a couple of times before you finally noticed where her horse was? Her horse really is not that hard to find, but it was mixed in with those other horses, meaning it can be hard to spot from certain angles. So overall, the reason I ended up missing the horse a couple of times was we walked past that large group of horses and I effectively never noticed Zelda's golden horse mixed into that one group. So I ended up looping around a couple of times without ever noticing Zelda's golden horse was mixed in with those other horses. But the other problem I was having was finding horses in general because not a lot of horses exist in that one area. So overall, in order to save time in the video, I basically cut past getting completely lost a few times. And I basically cut to where I finally found Zelda's golden horse. And that basically does show it is near the Gleok, but my problem was missing out on that one group of horses and never noticing Zelda's golden horse was mixed into that one group in the first place. But anyway, I'm sure a lot of you had a similar problem, so you can leave your thoughts, opinions, and answers in the comments. Or you can leave them on social media. All of my social media links as well as my Discord links are in the video description. Now, as always, I need to be a shill for a minute. If you subscribe to the channel and if you follow me on social media, that really helps our communities grow but anyway i hope you all enjoyed the video and i hope i will see you all next time so as always good morning good afternoon good evening or good night everybody i hope you come back someday see you later